All right, good morning from beautiful Nassau, Nassau Bahamas. Bahamas. Uh, it is 7.45, we are just pulling in now. Uh, I think we can get off the ship at 8.30 or at 9? 8.30, they said, so we're gonna go have breakfast. Yeah. And then today we are off to Sandals Royal Bahamian. So we're gonna check that out for some travelers that we have coming to um, stay there this summer. Um, and this fall, so we'll check it out and kind of get some first-hand experience for them, mm -hmm. um, get the lay of the land, yes. and then we get to be guests for the day. Yeah, so we have full access with the food and, and beverages and all that stuff. So that'll be a fun experience because we've done um, we've done Grand, uh, we've done Turks and Caicos, but it'll be nice to get a whole different experience on another island. So. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're looking forward to that. And last night, it was so calm. Like, we just were rocked gently to sleep. Yep, and we're, again, we are on the aft balcony. I know we've had people that have loved it, and we actually had a, a family uh, on uh, a trip recently that... Was not a fan. They were not a fan. Uh, but they had to actually go to the front desk and request that their room be changed because they were so uncomfortable. But, you know, it is what it is. It's, you know, it's all about preference. It's all about preference. Um, but I didn't feel any vibrations or any moving or anything like that. So I guess a lot of it does it have to awesome. do with the ship. So. And the weather, too. Like last night, it was smooth as glass. It yeah. was windy, but there were no waves. Yeah. I, a lot of it probably is weather as well. So let's go get some breakfast and uh, see if we can find some friends. All right. Nothing like a good breakfast buffet to start off the day. Right, Ashley? Yeah. Let's get in there, I'm hungry. All right, it is breakfast time. We have uh, avocado toast, hash browns, corned beef hash, my favorite, sausage, bacon, uh, scrambled eggs, and that's like a ball of mozzarella. I don't even, I just grabbed it because I like, who doesn't like cheese for breakfast? Uh, and an eggs benedict. And of course I had to get Ashley her mimosa. Hashtag kids free weekend. So, uh, sitting with a ton of our friends, everyone is showing up, say hi guys, hi. Uh, everyone's grabbing their food, so yeah, gonna chow down. to Nassau. We've got the, our ship here. What ship is this? The uh, Carnival Elation. Go and us. then Freedom of the Seas in front of us. We've got our friends uh, Jay and Amy with us. Say hi guys. Hi. Uh, oh hey guys. Hey guys. So uh, yeah gonna try to find a taxi and head over. Oh we got the uh, oh, we got the Wish. Is it the Wish? Yeah it is the Wish. You can see Rapunzel hanging off the back. Nice. All right, let's get a taxi. Look how shiny that ship is. Yeah, she's a beauty. I wouldn't know. I didn't get to sail on her. And right beside the wish is the uh, Virgin's newest cruise ship, the Valiant Lady. Uh, looks really cool. Um, I've seen a couple of uh, ship tours of it, and uh, it's definitely different. Um, it's adults only, so I don't know if we'd ever have a chance to actually do that cruise ship, uh, but it does look small. It actually looks smaller than the Wish. Um, but let's see if we can get a good shot from the side. Yeah, it's cool. It's big. Actually, not as small as I thought. Here's the new terminal that they've been building and working on for a while. Got another one down that way, too, but coming along. All right, guys, we are at the Sandals Royal uh, Bohemian. I'm uh, going to give you a quick tour of the resort and some of the amenities that they have to offer here. Uh, so let's go take a look. So this is the check-in area right when you want to spin it around. Um, just the check-in area, the welcome yep. reception. And then over to the left is the reception hall. So this is where you would check in. Uh, get your room keys, get your passes, do all that fun stuff. So, 
So here we have club sandals. This is for the concierge guests. If they want uh, to book any kind of services, they would come in here. We do have a lounge here as well. And then you can actually come and book your next uh, sandals trip here at this desk. Off to the side, we have the Balmoral Club. Uh, which is the, another lounge that do have a bar here on the left hand side looks like a piano bar beautiful little space very uh, nice with the natural lights and uh, air conditioner is pumping which is great so and off to the side of that we have the billiards room uh, here um, Nice little space, you can come play cards, chess, checkers, uh, tic-tac-toe, and of course you got two pool tables here, uh, but yeah, nice little space when you want to just get out of the sun and do something. Yeah, for sure. And then walking out uh, here you have the pool area. It's cold. Cold. Uh, with the beach down in the distance that way, but plenty of loungers, plenty of couches, plenty of space. And here is one of the many restaurants that they do have here on property, uh, Kano. Um, here people are having breakfast, which is uh, covered in the package price of the resort stay. And then here off to the side they have a couple of little huts here. This one is called Island Roots. Um, and it looks like it's an excursion desk with different types of excursions that you can book. Um, you come here to book your excursion and they would be more than happy to help. And right next door they have Snapshots, which is the professional photography center where after you've taken your photos, you can actually come here and uh, select a package. Uh, that works for you and there are a, a ton of different options here to choose from uh, with different price points for everyone's budget um, we did do a photo shoot when we stayed at beaches turks and caicos and i highly recommend uh, doing it when you come to stay at a beaches or sandals resort all right we took a quick loop around from uh, that first pool out over here we got two uh, food trucks here. One is coffee uh, is so and the good. crepes. What'd you get? I got the Caribbean coffee. Oh, wow. So good. Oh, it sounds good. We do have another bar here and uh, another big pool over here uh, with the beach down that way. So, <laughs> looks beautiful. Let's check it out. I'm walking down to the ferry boat to the private island here on the pier. They do have some. Uh, bohemian souvenirs and trinkets and cool things like that but they do have the beach here uh, it is split in two with the pier uh, so you got it here on this side and then when you go over to this side uh, you have the beach there as well and then that is the line to get on the ferry so let's see if we can hop on board and uh, go to the private island right across the way so we're gonna take the ferry over to the private island uh, one thing to note uh, no shoes allowed got to make sure you take them off uh, when coming on board so got a pretty full boat um, oh, there you go. a whole lot of people so we're gonna head on over and uh, check out their private island yeah see what it has what it has to offer yeah all right we just got off the ferry now we're gonna head over here and check out the uh, island beach and uh, the pool and the bar. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Woohoo? Woo woo. Sounds a woo woo. We'll try it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Let's go. I don't know, but I'm going to Oh. Yeah, you want to get one? <laughs> That's not bad. Three. 
So uh, this is a nice little private beach here, uh, very quiet, waves are very minimal, and uh, the water is crystal clear, and uh, the, uh, it's actually not too cold. So nice little spot, as soon as you get off uh, where the ferry drops you off, uh, you just take the, uh, the pier, walk it down, and grab uh, some chairs with umbrellas, and then you can uh, have yourself a day. And then up from the ferry and the beach, you do have the uh, bar here. Uh, great selection. Uh, they have a drink called uh, Woo Woo, uh, which I think is cranberry juice and some sort of uh, rum. Um, but really nice. Uh, and off to the side of that, they have Aralia House uh, Offshore Grill. This restaurant, you actually do need to wear a shirt and um, shoes uh, to come eat here so you just need to make sure that you bring that stuff with you uh, when you come to the private island and then off to the side they do have a small pool area with a swim up bar and plenty of chairs and umbrellas and private cabanas here uh, I like the cabanas because it has a table a couch uh, two chairs on the side and then a ceiling fan, which is great. Uh, and then you can close the curtain for privacy, but they're a nice little feature uh, that are added here at the resort. And then right in the back, they do have a nice little water feature. Uh, you cannot go swimming in here, but it just adds a nice little background noise uh, to, the, to the space while you're hanging out by the pool, relaxing or having a drink, listening to some music. And then on the back side of the islands is the other portion of the beach. This is built more like a lagoon with the rocks off to the side, but still plenty of chairs. And you got chairs with umbrellas here on the sides. Uh, plenty of options of places to come and hang and relax and uh, let loose. I do still have some outdoor seating here from the restaurant uh, for people that do want to be closer to uh, the ocean, uh, but it is connected to uh, the dining space here on the side. And then off the, to the side of the restaurant, they do have the restrooms here. Uh, people can come and use the amenities here. Uh, they do have a foosball table here for some adults that just want to do something else besides swim and drink and relax. And last but not least, they do have a designated smoking area here for adults that do smoke cigarettes. Um, do have a uh, couch space here with the ashtray uh, there, so that way there's no um, you know cigarette butts on the beach. Keep it nice and clean. Uh, so that's going to do it for the private island tour of the sandals video. Uh, we're going to be taking the ferry over shortly and uh, checking out the rest of the resort. Headed to lunch now. Uh, we're gonna grab a bite to eat over here. Calico. Calico, yeah. So um, definitely more lively now than it was before. Yeah, music's playing. I think it was because it was so early in the morning, but I think it was. Yeah, I think it was just early. I think people can sleep in here. It's not like a mad dash to find a seat. There's definitely plenty of chairs available, even now. Yeah, okay. for sure. Alright guys, we are at Calico Cafe. Yeah. Our friend Amy took a little bit of a spill a few minutes ago, <laughs> but she's doing okay now. We are uh, gonna get some lunch. Ashley, you know what you're getting? First thoughts? All those nachos look pretty good. Loaded nachos, yeah, Ashley loves nachos. Steak and cheese, chicken Caesar wrap, I don't know, there's a couple good things. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I'm hungry. All 
right guys, we are headed back on the ship. Ashley is ready to do some water slides. And uh, we're gonna head back on and uh, have some fun. What time is it now? It's 2.42. Ship not doesn't leave. Today. Ship does not, not leave until uh, 4.30. Um, but last call to get on the ship is actually four o'clock. So we're an hour and 20 minutes early. Uh, had a fun day at Sandals. Uh, we asked to take a room tour three separate times and Bought it never happened. Yeah, three separate answers. So um, wanted to do that for our subscribers, for our clients when we book vacations for people tried to patch together a uh, quick resort tour as best as I could so I'll drop that in after this video hope you guys like it I was just limited with what I had but yeah I'm gonna go on the ship maybe use the bathroom because she has to go to the bathroom cream. every 15 minutes and uh, you now let's have some fun all right we are uh, offloaded at the room and now we're heading up to the pool. Ashley wants a drink because she's oh, been drinking all cream. day. I want ice cream. So we're going to go get her a nice little drink. Maybe I some ice really cream. I do really like those Curacao Cosmos. She really those does. Are. And also the pineapple sangria. Totally. It's like right up my alley, those two. Yeah. So um, what time is it? It's like 3. No. 3.10. So hot tub. So we have. Sail away. Sail But we have dinner at 5.30, so still need a factor in getting dressed and everything and ready for dinner and Boy. stuff, so. I know, but like we have, we don't have much time. That's the whole point that I'm trying to say is we just gotta get ready, so let's have some fun. All right, all right, all right. I think we found the entrance to the water slides and the flow rider. You gotta walk all the way to the back. All the way to the back and up it. the stairs. And poor Ashley's just been so confused, so lost. Wow, look at this line. Oh, nice. This is cool. Alright, we got the sports court over here. Um, I don't know sky what this guy is doing. I feel like we cannot tell Nolan this ship had a sky pad. He's going to be so upset. Oh, yeah, that sky pad is up there. That's like a uh, bungee cord kind of thing, right? Yeah. And we got the uh, rock climbing wall over there. Oh. Homeboy is... Uh, oh, no, that's not the thing that he wanted. He wanted the eye fly. Oh, that's what it was. Like the sky diving. I think we go up the stairs. Oh. All right, let's get out. This ship is so great for kids. Look at the splash pad. How awesome is this thing? So much to do for little ones. I love it. All right, I just left the casino up 125 bucks. And I don't know why, but Ashley's bringing me right back in. I'm just trying to leave and Ashley keeps sucking me back into this place. Ashley, why are you doing this to me? Yeah, Studio B is hard to get to, she says. All right, let's get out of here.